Hello everyone, you are welcome. How to solve and evaluate the value of this beautiful math problem, which is 1 over 5 raised to power 1 over 5. One over five. So how can we solve this problem? Here first of all, we will change this number to radical form. So we know that we can write any root of any number a in expression form as a raised to power 1 over n. So here this number is in this exponential form. So we will change it from this exponential form to radical form. So this will become is equal to fifth root of 1 over 5. Now here we will use another result. And we will take this fifth root over numerator and denominator. So here we will use this one result. We can write n root of a divided by b is n root of a divided by n root of b. So using this result here, we can write this number as this will become fifth root of one divided by fifth root of 5 now remember that any root of 1 is always equal to 1 so if n is any number root of 1 this is always 1 so here we will replace this number with 1 so this will become 1 by fifth root of 5 and if we can write this number as 1 by fifth root of so here we will use another result so here we will use this one result we can write 1 by any root of a is here we will multiply and divide some numbers so here we multiply this number any root of a raised to power n minus 1 and we will also divide this number here so this will become n root of a raised to power n minus 1 so we will use this one result here and we multiply this number with number like this so we will do here times this will become fifth root of 5 raised to power n is 5 so 5 minus 1 we will also divide this number here fifth root of 5 raised to power 5 minus 1. Now let's simplify this number and this number. So this will become 1 over fifth root of 5 times. And this will become fifth root of 5 raised to power 5 minus 1 is 4. Denominator will become also this number. So this will become fifth root of 5 raised to power 4. Now here we multiply these two numbers. So we will multiply numerator with numerator and denominator with denominator. So this number will become 1 times this number is this one number. So this is fifth root of 5 raised to power 4 divided by and here we multiply these two numbers so this will become fifth root of 5 times fifth root of 5 raised to power 4 now here in this number fifth root of 5 times fifth root of 5 raised to power 4 we will use another radical identity another radical result so here we will use this one result we can write any root of a times n root of b is n root of a times b so using this result we can write this denominator as this will become numerator will be the same fifth root of 5 raised to power 4 divided by and here this will become we will multiply the basis so this will become 5 times 5 raised to power 4.
having fifth root now look at two these two numbers these two numbers having the same base so here we will add their powers so this will become fifth root of 5 raised to power 4 and this will become we will add their power so we will become 5 raised to power 1 plus 4 having fifth root now let's further simplify this number so this will become 5 raised to power 4 fifth root divided by fifth root of 5 raised to power 1 plus 4 is 5 now what we will do here, here we will change these two numbers in the numerator and denominator to the radical form. So again we will lose the result that we use in the start of this problem. That is, we can write nth root of any number a, exponential form is a raised to power 1 by that root n. So using this result, we can write this numerator and denominator as, this will become... 5 raised to power 4 and this will become 1 by 5 divided by 5 raised to power 5 whole raised to power 1 over 5 now here in the numerator and denominator we will use an exponential identity and we will multiply the powers with each other so here we will use this one exponential identity a raised to power m whole raised to power n which can also be written as r to power m times n so using this identity here we can write this numerator and denominator as this will become 5 raised to power you multiply the powers this will become 4 times 1 over 5 and same we will do here 5 raised to power 5 times 1 by 5 so here these two powers will be cancel each other because they are the reciprocal of each other and here we will multiply the power so this will become 4 times 1 is 4 divided by 5 so this will become 5 raised to power 4 by 5 and the denominator is 5 raised to power here only 1 is left now here in this one step we will use another exponential identity and we will move this number to the numerator so here we will use this one identity in this step we can write a raised to power m divided by a raised to power n as a raised to power we will subtract the power so this will become a raised to power m minus n so using this one result here we can write this as this will become 5 raised to power we will subtract the power so this will become 4 by 5 minus 1 now here you will take it same in the power so this will become 5 raised to power so the same will be 5 so dividing 5 by 5 gives him 1 1 times 4 is 4 dividing 5 by 1 gives him 5 5 times 1 is 5 so this will become 4 minus 5 so let's put a simplify this number this will become 5 raised to power here 4 minus 5 is minus 1 divided by 5 here this power is negative so we will move this number to the denominator so this power will become positive so we can write Further, this is 1 by 5 raised to power 1 over 5. Now, here the power is positive. Or we can write this number in radical form as 1 by 5th root of 5. So, finally, 1 by 1 raised to power 1 by 5 or 1 by 5th root of 5 is our final answer. And final value of This is beautiful math problem. Now in last, if you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel for such a more interesting and step-by-step -step math videos. Thanks for watching.